Whether you're having a snack, cleaning the never-ending pile of dishes, busy brushing your teeth, doing all kinds of sports, and, well, many other everyday tasks, almost everywhere we come face to face with food, nutrition, and hygiene. Of course, you already know that there is a Bachelor of Science about this and where to find it. But what else is there for you to learn and discover? And why should you study in Siegmaring? Let's get down to business. Okay, the hearsay is true. Siegmaring is not your typical concrete jungle. In the city itself, you can expect to meet people like this. But in all honesty, the university here has a whole lot to offer. There is a reason why the course Food, Nutrition and Hygiene was given the rating very good by the CHE in 2010. With exemplary laboratories for sensory analysis of food, food chemistry or microbiology, students get a good foundation for a successful college education. And besides, we even have our own brewing facilities. But just a warning. There will be some difficult general subjects with scary content that everyone has to go through. Classes like differential equations and mathematics, wave physics, and statistics. But no worries. Here are some comforting words from the fresh prince of statistics himself. Keine Sorge, liebe Studierende, Sie werden es schon irgendwie schaffen. So, you heard the prince. Don't worry, because you won't be on your own. Students from higher semesters offer help through tutorials and the so-called open learning rooms. And on top of that, you will find countless exercise books and so much more in our excellently led library. When you finally pass your freshman year, the real fun begins. In microbiology, you're going to cultivate several microorganisms, while in molecular biology, you can modify them genetically. Furthermore, you will get to know why everybody tastes everything everywhere and why you neutralize this with that and those with these. You will also learn about the European Union food law and whether or not sawdust is really allowed to be in fruit yogurt. Learn how to pinpoint if what you're reading is trustworthy or nonsense. Is my neighbor overweight? Is my protein intake enough? What's the difference between sanitary and canteen kitchen hygiene? What does result-oriented cleaning mean? And why is this bacterium allowed to be in a clean room? How do refrigerators, ovens, deep fryers and coffee machines work? And what do you get when you combine these ingredients? Chances are that you will become an expert in Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, Excel, Project, Visio and Citavi as well. Uh, oh well, forget about Word. There are also lots of language courses that you can choose from. And if you feel like your head is exploding from all of this new knowledge, you can cool down in the university's pub where all the party animals are hanging out. But enough university talk. I can already hear people screaming, What about professional practice? Well, I am pleased to inform you that there's a lot of it, because the fifth semester is the internship semester. There, you will have the opportunity to apply your theoretical knowledge to practical work. And for those who love to travel, there's good news for you too. The Siegmaring University is connected to a lot of partner schools all over the world. For example, France, Finland, Scotland, Hungary, Mexico, Brazil, South Africa, Australia, Indonesia, Malaysia, and Korea. Uh, I, I mean, the other one. Once you're back from your trip and you've earned your degree, many job opportunities in different fields await you. Typical professions are quality management in the food industry, at pharmaceutical companies, in medical technology corporations, or the cosmetic industry. Of course, you can also work in production or even take on a leadership role. How about a job in public catering or in the field of canteen kitchen planning? You want to work as a nutritionist or a product developer for food products or kitchen equipment? That's also possible. Or maybe you're more interested in cleaning chemistry and technique. No problem. Perhaps you want to venture into teaching and pass on your knowledge to others. Or do you want to protect people from possible dangers? Even professions in the vast field of marketing and distribution are not unusual. 
or taking a job in public institutions in the nutrition and agriculture sector, or maybe being a freelancer, for example, as the head of a cleaning service company, or simply becoming a CEO, and so on and so forth. Or maybe all you really want is just being a student forever. And even that is possible at our university. How does that work? Well, that's another story in another video.